Oh, my hand is so incredibly itchy right now. I don't even, like I literally just pressed the start recording button and all of a sudden my hand is just unbearably itchy. So uh, this is a problem and I feel like we need to address this problem. This is something we need to talk about and I just realized it sounds like I'm still talking about my hand. I guess my itchy hand is a big problem, but I'm, I'm now trying to address the topic of today's video. So this, I mean, I didn't want it to become a problem. I didn't think it was going to become a problem and this is why I haven't addressed it so far. But right now it does seem like it is becoming a bit of a bigger problem that we kind of do need to talk about. We need to talk about this right now. Before people start aggressively fanning the flames to this and it just starts growing bigger and bigger and bigger and just eventually gets out of control. I need. We need to douse the fire right now before it gets to that stage. Hey, you know what? Let's see some numbers on this one. Please leave a like on this video and subscribe if you are not surprised that we are talking about yet another problem. Basically, I, it was like a month ago or over a month ago at this point, I received a comment on a video and it was just, somebody just randomly said out of nowhere, day one of asking Chloe to say, hey demons, welcome to hell. And my, my thought process when seeing this comment was kind of like, Okay, I know people don't usually pay attention to the comments that are like a day one of asking YouTuber to do this certain thing, but when I saw this, it was just, it was so incredibly fitting. I've never seen anything more fitting than people telling me to welcome my demons to hell. And especially when we are talking about kind of like more negative updates that Roblox is bringing us. So after seeing someone literally request me to say, hey demons, welcome to hell, you can imagine the excitement that just immediately lit up within me. And honestly, if you have watched any of my videos in the last month or so, you will know that I took that suggestion and I ran with that suggestion. Hey demons, welcome to hell pretty much became my regular intro to my videos, which I usually didn't have an intro, but to say like five small little words that takes barely three seconds, didn't seem like it was gonna be too big of a change to my videos. But here's the thing, here is I guess where the problem kind of started, or at least it wasn't a problem to begin with up until like very, very recently I noticed. But after I included that one comment in my video and I was like, look, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say the thing, hey demons, welcome to hell, this is my thing now. I feel like people took that as an opportunity to do the same thing, which I don't have a problem with. A lot of my comments from that moment were, you know, the same old day one of asking Chloe to do this thing. And again, reiterating, making it very crystal clear right now, I, I never ever had a problem with that. And people have asked me, do you have a problem with seeing these types of comments a lot? And I don't, I, I genuinely couldn't care less. It doesn't even cross my mind as a problem, but I've been getting the comments literally from the second I took the suggestion of that one person who commented day one of asking Chloe to say, hey demons, welcome to hell. Honestly, thinking about it now, I absolutely 100% should have fully expected so many other people to try the same exact thing so that they maybe could also get into a video or so that you know they could see me taking their suggestions but for some reason I just didn't expect to see it happening whatsoever. I don't, <laughs> why was I so unprepared for something that was so incredibly predictable? So obviously at this point we've established, and I mean, you could have watched my previous videos over the last month and already realized this, but I took the hey demons, welcome to hell thing and I ran with it and I honestly kind of love it a lot. I, I love using it at this point. And so I never really planned to take any other suggestions, at least not right now because I was having so much fun with hey demons, welcome to hell. Despite people literally keeping this up for over a month, like literally a lot of you guys are very, very dedicated and I appreciate it, I guess. Like I'm pretty sure the highest number I've seen so far is somebody is on day 29 or day 30, which is a month. People have been doing this for a whole month. They have been commenting their things for a whole month. But even so, I had absolutely zero problems with people commenting things like that in the first place. The whole day 29 of asking Chloe to say this certain sentence of words literally isn't harming anyone. It's not harming a single soul and it's not a bad thing in the slightest. So when I title this video that, you know, there, there is a problem that we need to address and when I'm saying this is a big problem, we need to talk about this. I'm not talking about those comments. I am not talking about those comments. If you have ever commented something like that, please don't think I'm talking about you commenting something like that. You're not hurting anyone. You're not doing anything wrong. And that's why I never saw a reason to address it up until very recently, like literally yesterday, which is where, you know, the actual problem we need to address comes into play.
play because I noticed quite a fair amount of people had started bringing up how annoying or frustrating it is you know, by the increasing amount of comments that are like this. Now you see, I have always and I will always only want my community and my comment section to be a place where everyone can either have fun and communicate with each other or respectfully debate and discuss with, with each other, which is kind of what it always has been up until recently. It's kind of, this is what I'm saying. It's a very small fire right now and I'd prefer to douse it before it does start getting out of control. And you know, so we can kind of keep the peace because either way, all I have ever wanted is peace and harmony amongst all of us. And so when it comes to a point of half of the comments are people commenting pretty much the same thing over and over again and the other half of the comments are people saying how annoying it's becoming when all they want to do is talk about the video or you know read comments about other people talking about the video I feel like that's kind of where I need to step in and draw the line it's not typically something I wanted to address it you know it's not necessarily the most fun thing in a world in the world to come between conflict but there is a point where things do start to go too far and I'd rather prevent that from happening before it does happen but I again want to reiterate 100% that this isn't personal at all look not even on either side like I have never ever had a problem with anyone commenting this type of thing not even once have I seen it to personally be annoying so if you have ever commented like that then please do not feel bad whatsoever. And I also don't have a problem with people saying that this is becoming annoying. Like I'm not going to tell people what to be annoyed by and what not to be annoyed by as long as, you know, it's within reason. But even with that in mind, I can admit that it's a little bit confusing to me to see other people getting upset or, you know, becoming annoyed over something on my behalf. But ultimately, I know people are just trying to look out for me and obviously look out for each other. So when it comes down to it, at the end of the day, no one is in the wrong here and absolutely nothing about this situation situation is deep like not even in the slightest it doesn't matter it doesn't change anything but I am simply here today to request eternal peace amongst my own little demons the inhabitants of hell so when all is said and all is done it would probably be for the best to see both types of these comments stop or at least decrease a little bit and for everyone to just go back to talking and discussing things about whatever the video was about or even just kindly and respectfully conversing normally with one another but even if a few people here and there still continue to comment those day one of asking Chloe to do this or to say this, please just leave them alone, leave them be. We don't attack or harass anyone for literally any reason whatsoever and especially when that person isn't doing anything wrong at all. So one more time, please make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe because I will always appreciate the love and support that you guys give me and you know what? It helps me out a lot. What do we get think of? I don't even know what to say. I'm just here trying to request peace amongst the people in my own community, my demons. Please be nice to each other, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.